welcome. <laughs> I'm not yet ready to start sculpting, but I figured I'm still gonna check in for a second. Um, I'm still on my morning tea. That's what I've been drinking for the past half an hour. It's miserable. It's miserable outside. Hence the light I just switched on to have a little bit more cozy vibes in here. I will probably change my table to be in front of the window so I have a little bit more light source and I don't have to turn on the headlights in my room. But we will see. So, welcome to Uncomfy Cherry. My name is Tinti and today is my first studio vlog. Who is gonna tell you to eat the rainbow? So, I went in a little bit of a spiral. sketchbook so I see my sketch actually but I do have my concept art for the first three keychains on here there you go and I will probably make the original beetroot keychain also into a desk front and then I have some additional small charms, which I'm gonna try today um, too. So I have a lot to do today. And it's my first day sculpting after 10 years. <laughs> so we will see how it goes. But I'm excited. And I can't wait to, to make those little guys happen, actually. They're, already like very implemented in my brain but not yet in real life so that's the plan i'm gonna quickly go get myself ready and then i'm gonna be right back um also i'm probably gonna start sitting and not standing and change to standing later because i think um my concentration level will be a little bit better when I'm sitting. So, okay, I'm gonna exchange this. Or, where did I put this? Okay, I, I brought a jar to, <laughs> to um, put all the stuff in there which I use. It just started snowing. So this jar is for all the uh, dirty stuff, which I would probably produce today. That also needs to find some space on this tiny table. Okay, I'm gonna put it here. Also, I forgot about my... Oh, 
here we go. The first little body is done. I'm gonna put it here right now and I'm gonna go work on the feet. Okay, the little munchkin is already done. Um, I'm not gonna make the leaves. I think I'm gonna do it mainly with this. Maybe I mix in a little bit of white to get lighter, but we will see. Oh, that was nerve-wracking. <laughs> oh my god, I'm slightly like nervous for this, but it's okay. has collected a little bit of the green. Okay, he got leaves. Look at him. Oh, you can't see him. There you go. <laughs> it's so cute. <laughs> nice. This is exciting. <laughs> I'm like sitting here looking at the snow falling outside even though it was already over winter it's still beautiful to look at when it snows like this okay i need a tiny tiny little bit of, of this because it's just the face and that's gonna be so so small Okay, and last but not least, look at how cute he is. Last but not least, he's gonna get a little ass crack. Okay, last but not least, I'm working on the third beetroot keychain now. And that's gonna be the granny <laughs> who is gonna tell you to eat the rainbow, basically. So yeah, that's that's the plan right now. I'm gonna make this clay soft so I can make her. And then that's that. <laughs> like I'm smiling hardcore because I'm just honestly so excited to do this. This is making my child very, very happy right now, my inner child. Okay, my little granny root. <laughs> She's still missing her face, but I'm gonna make the apron first and I'm gonna use those two colors because I think that would look super cute. By the way, it's still snowing outside. <laughs> it's crazy. This is literally crumbling through the machine. This is such a weird texture, like... It's very... It breaks so easy. Well... Trial and error. That was an error. So 
mixing green. Let's just take all the green I have and all the white. Cut off some more white. Is this gonna be the same? I will see. Okay, before I apply this, I will do the rest because this is otherwise gonna probably like die. Here we have the little apron. It's kind of cute though. Cute. There we go. Granny. All done. My hair is still in my sweater because I got a little bit cold so I put on a sweater. I'm having cereals for breakfast which technically it's already lunchtime. Another tea and then I'm gonna do a few tiny little charms which might be additional to the beetroot, the baby root and the granny root <laughs> keychains. Okay, so I'm gonna throw them on the baking tray. I'm not gonna throw them. I'm gonna gently put them <laughs> on the baking tray and then I'm gonna bake them and I will be back with the final result of all the pieces. I'm so excited. So when my pieces are baking, I'm gonna clean up my station and prepare it for the painting part and the assembly part and yeah I'm so excited I'm so excited for them to be done <sighs> it's so nice okay gonna probably finish this tea and then I'm gonna clean up my station but you will see So yesterday I went in a little bit of a spiral and did another round of little beetroot guys. So this is round one and this is round two because I felt like they need to be a little bit lighter in color so you can actually see the eyes and stuff. So today what we're gonna do is hopefully the last trial. I'm gonna do probably as many as I can fit in to do today. So I have a few to um, use for marketing. And also one of them at least goes into a little keychain trial, but yeah. Nice. So we have nine big ones, five small ones, and for the feet and everything, we got this piece.
notes are all blanketed up. They're so cute, honestly. <laughs> so now I'm gonna do the dress, like the apron of the granny. Okay, everything is ready to be baked. I decided to do the carrots separately and glue them on the hands later. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna put it on the tray now and then I'm gonna bake it. but that's how it is sometimes in the studio. I also, while I was sculpting today, got my new um, table and I'm gonna set that up today, I think after all the things I've baked and stuff. And I got myself a tiny little thing i show you. But I got this yesterday and I want to just make it look cute and my table is going to come next to it. And yeah, I think I'm going to do that today. Hey there, I <laughs> look completely different because I went outside and I needed my pullover, which is super warm. I can't really uh, wear it when I am sculpting, that's what I said. So yeah, I did my little corner <laughs> it's not ready yet at all but that's what it is right now and i will show you my little bit rude friends but i will probably show you again tomorrow morning because as you can see it's pitch black outside <laughs> it's after five so yeah i'm gonna do a close-up of them right now okay so here they are this is granny right out of the oven her little carrots look at how cute they are then we have baby root being super cute over here and we have the traditional beetroot right there i'm gonna go and finish with the painting on them today so i'm gonna paint their little Thongs because they need painting. Also, I will slightly clean them up after the baking, all the little bits and pieces which still need a little bit of finishing. And then I will show you before glazing them tomorrow. Hi there, I'm right now prepping my things to glaze. I just stick it onto tape, I think that will be making them slightly elevated and therefore hopefully not stick to anything but the sticky tape. We will see if it works out. Hi there, I just started editing. Uh, whole vlog and realized it's way too long <laughs> so I'm gonna split it up in two and you will see the rest of the process of my tiny little clay beetroot keychains in the next video but for now thank you very much for watching I hope you enjoyed this vlog I hope you have a beautiful day and we we'll see each other in the next video which is gonna be the <laughs> continuing part of this film